What is up guys, this is Weezak7 of Weezak Games, and we are in the official release of Minecraft 1.0.0, and someone just started talking to me. Okay, there we go. So, since my server is not yet updated, we're going to go into single player, let's go, where's my creative mode? Here we go, let's go here, no, you know what, let's make a new world. And we'll call this, um... Official release world. Game mode creative. Because I'm going to show you some features of the new Minecraft. Um, it is very likely that you have already you already know this if you're into Minecraft. If you're not into Minecraft, you probably don't care. So I think this video is largely going to be pretty pointless for a lot of people. But, whatever. I... it just... it seemed appropriate to bring up my week of Minecraft. So, doo -doo -doo. hopefully this one will go up on time, unlike yesterday's. Because I slept super late. Let's see, we're in a swamp. Cool. Cool, swamps are cool. Let's give everything a chance to load in. Alright, so let's see. What's different? Do, 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 do. Oh, we got some nether brick stuff. Well, those tooltips look different. Weird. There's like a purple block around them. Oh, some mycelium. At least that's how you pronounce that. Some lily pads. Oh, you can place grass and a fern. So that's cool. I suppose I should keep looking up here, make sure I don't miss anything. Soul sand, gravel. Okay, this stuff's all the same. Oh, a dead brush. Sponge. Oh, wait, sponges and everything. Oh, wait a minute. I'm stupid. This stuff, just because this stuff's in the creative inventory, doesn't mean you can actually place it in survival mode. Although, I do seem to recall reading something about being able to place ferns and grass now. But, that may not be the case, and I don't want to provide false information. What's that over there, and why isn't it loading? Load! 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 It's because I have fraps going, isn't it? There. Wait a minute, let's see, what do we got? So we've got... Nether brick. That looks pretty cool. It's just a plain old block. Nothing fancy. Oh, that's cobblestone. Alright, I think this needs to be placed in the water. What is this? Huh, why is this stuff gray? I can play some lily pads, that's cool. Place grass. Why is this stuff gray? Is that part of this? Is that a swamp thing? I have gray grass? Makes it look swampier? Hmm. And other brick fences, just work like regular fences, stairs, or. Okay, so there's nothing really all that interesting there. Um. I guess I guess swamp grass is just gray now. Oh, that's kind of dumb. I don't I don't I don't really think I like that. I guess it does make it look swampier, I suppose. Anyway, so what else have we got here? We got some of this mycelium. Which is in the mushroom biomes. We'll see if we can find some of those in a minute. Um, what else have we got? Anything else off the top of the head? Oh, an enchantment table. Well, bam. I can theoretically enchant things with. But I don't have any XP to do it with, so there's not a whole lot I can do. We'll try enchanting my sword anyway, just for shits and giggles. Um, looks like those are all the new blocks. What is this? Oh, just a different icon for the golden apple. Um, oh, something else. Okay, milk. Milk is now a um, cure-all thing that resets your status, gets rid of any buffs or debuffs that you've got. Um, what have we got here? Pumpkin seeds, milk. Okay, oh, this stuff's all old stuff. A blaze rod. A brewing stand. An eye of ender. Glistening melons. Oh, all kinds of new music discs. 
which I'll play for you guys shortly. Um, well, you know what? I'll just do this now. The brewing stand, or uh, the brewing stand requires a lot of stuff that I don't know what to do. Off the top of my head, um, it requires very specific components, and I don't, I don't know what they all are right off the top of my head. Let's let's play some music, and then we'll go try and find some new features. And a lot of this stuff I will probably be showing you in um. I'm I'm gonna go look for a uh, a mushroom biome while I talk, which I probably won't find one soon, but because I think they're pretty rare. But yeah, the the alchemy. For those of you don't who don't know, the uh, the two main well, two of the main things that are coming that are here with the official release are enchantment and alchemy. Um, the former allows you to improve weapons and tools with all sort with all sorts of various things. I don't know if you can have multiple enchantments on the same thing. I don't. I didn't look into it that much because I haven't played any of the pre-release stuff. Excuse me, because I figured there's enough bugs with the game normally that I don't need to fiddle around with the pre-release stuff. Um, and, hold on, I'm going to let everything load in real quick. Okay, there we go. Things are loaded in better. This must be the swamp grass, looks like. That's kind of weak, I don't really like that. I don't like how gray it is. Anyway, um, oh yeah, I, 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 haven't, I haven't fiddled around with the pre-release stuff much, so I don't know for sure. Um, but I know you can put multiple in... You can you can you get multiple enchantments. I don't know if you can put multiple ones on a single tool, but um. Okay, I'm just gonna fiddle with this stuff here because I can't explore where Fraps is running. T everything takes too long to load. And here, let, let's let's kill some things. And get some XP. Oh, they don't show the XP. No, you just have to trust me that it's there. I'll be able to show you some of this, some of the enchanting stuff. In fact, I think I'll show the enchanting stuff when my when my, our survival server is up, because then I'll actually have this, the resources and the uh, XP to demonstrate it properly. Well, let's see if there's anything. Can I put this in here? And you can see that there's options of things to enchant it with. I don't have a sufficient level for any of that though. They're random. So that's kind of cool. Um, but those, those enchantments range from doing more damage to um, allowing you to pick up any block you break. Like even ones, like normally when you break stone with a pickaxe, you don't get stone, you get cobblestone. But with the proper enchantment, you could get stone. Um, there's stuff for like breaking things quicker underwater. Just all, all kinds of cool stuff, really. Um. Oh. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. Um, let's see, we're gonna show some case on this. The alchemy, however, I can do right now in theory because all right, I need a cauldron of water and a bucket of water. So okay, so the alchemy you can get potions, which makes all sorts of things like. Health potions, strength potions, all sorts of various and sundry potions that do various and sundry effects. Wait, what? Does this really drop every time I take a thing of water out of it? Then what the hell good is it? That's dumb. That's really dumb. It does. Okay, I don't want this. Go away. Let's get a stack of these. Now we're all out of water. Okay, well this is stupid. I'm making my own water pool. There, problem solved. Okay, so let's take some of these. Oh, fuck, they take they take up an individual space. Oh, lame! How do I access a crafting thing? 
I don't. Not without a crafting table, it looks like. Get out of here. You too. Okay, uh, so, oh, okay, there we go. It's just in my inventory, which I don't know how to access. Okay, so something else that, that that's um, new is you can make these Eyes of Ender, which will point you toward strongholds as well as open the gate to the end. Um, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, you can also throw these pearls. Nope, never mind. I thought you could throw these pearls and it would teleport you to where they land and then you take damage, but I guess that is no longer the case. So they're only used for making Eyes of Ender now. Which... Oh, where'd it go? Okay, so apparently that way is our stronghold. Well, we'll worry about, we'll worry about that later. Uh, let's set up some potions. I'm going to need some reagents. I don't know what goes into potions, really. Hold on, let me, let me take a quick look at the wiki.